all right i do know it's a little bit noisy here but um well what i want to record today is um the message that i just got actually it's one that i got before um like a week ago a couple of days ago and one when i wrote it down just right now something else came in and explained the message that i got before a little bit deeper and broader and it's about what is going on on earth right now where are we heading so basically what was told what they told me my guides spirits angels actually was that they are creating a new kind of school on earth a new earth school and many of us we do know that earth is a realm where we incarnate in to experience certain things to learn certain things um many call it karma um i call it mastering the mind and stepping into the heart space and creating a world that is based on love a love-based reality i personally think that is why we are here so the message was that angels are actually establishing a new kind of school meaning earth as it was known or is known till today up until today is a place where we were experiencing even if we have, we have a lot of love even if earth itself has the vibration of unconditional love what we experience on earth is a kind of duality a lot of love a lot of mystical magical things on the one hand on the other hand there's a lot of destruction a lot of density a lot of darkness that i personally think it's not as clearly seen as it is but people do perceive that duality and they say like that is the, the normal thing that's why we here um, experiencing that duality and, and balancing that out within us right but that is the old school here on earth that is the old school and we are slowly shifting into a new kind of school and the pandemic that we are experiencing is kind of a very important part of that shift. It's shifting from that dense, really kind of harsh and hard 3D dimension of frequency into something more vibrating on a higher frequency and we can call it 5d we can call it 4d but it is basically a new school that holds a higher frequency that means it holds more of the love frequency it will hold more of the frequency that um loses attachment to duality it loses attachment to duality and completely shifts into something harmonious that is the new school that angels are establishing right now on earth and that means that everybody who is incarnated now or will incarnate in, in the future is contributing to that shift to build up that new kind of school so that 
future souls, including ourselves, we, we want that. When we will incarnate on Earth later on, we will not incarnate to learn how to deal with duality, to learn how to deal with our own demons. We will learn, we will incarnate to learn something different. If we incarnate later on on, on Earth, it's out of another reason. We have another intention, we have another purpose, we have another agenda, we have another task. And the task will be to experience that harmonious love frequency where it's not about the struggle but it might more be about vibing in that frequency and experiencing what you can build out of that out of a love-based reality in the future i don't know when in the future that will be like in hundred years, in thousand years, in five thousand years, but I do know what we're experiencing right now is that shift. That shift that we are experiencing, it's because Earth itself is changing. The spiritual realm is changing. The purpose on what beings can learn on Earth. It's like when you go Let me, let me find an example. Let's say you are a being in a spaceship, driving, flying around in the cosmos, in the universe, and you want to grow, like you want to learn stuff. You're just driving around, you're flying around, and you want to learn stuff. So. And you know there are different schools out there in different places where you can learn different things and you have heard about that place um, let's say Kwakutso. Kwakutso a world that teaches you how to um, use your psychic gift like you learn how to um, use telepathy, you learn how to fly, you learn how telekinesis, you learn um, how to ignite fire, um, for example. And then you have heard of that other world called Wasam. And Wasam is a world where you um, see more of the dark side. Um, you see entities that you have never seen before and that scare you, that frighten you. And you know, when you go there, it's because you want to learn more about your fears and um, integrate them and overcome them. And then maybe you have heard of another world that um, teaches something else. So that is what's happening in our universe. There are different places where you can go to learn something specific. And apparently once in a while, that world, a one world, after a while, changes itself so drastically that what you can learn there will be something new that before on that planet has not existed that is what is happening on earth right now it has been a place where we dealt with duality and it will be a place where we experience a more harmonious love-based reality and i think everybody if you resonate with that, if you feel that, it's if you feel what I'm saying, it's because you yourself, you have 
decided to come on earth to contribute to that shift. Um, and to make that experience yourself, to step into more harmony, into more balance, into more love. And I think this is what our focus has to be on, truly. Um, if we step into analyzing and thinking why things are going bad, why we are experiencing suffering, it's a vicious cycle. We get trapped in that. So I think it's very important to know what is happening right now on Earth so that we realize all we need to do actually is have our focus on a love-based reality so that it can the entire earth can merge more and more into that and you yourself too where we put our focus on that is where our energy flows towards and i think we can without guilt truly kiss goodbye the old kiss goodbye the density kiss goodbye the duality kiss goodbye the sadness kiss goodbye <laughs> entities that feeding off of our despair kiss goodbye the first frustration kiss goodbye the fear and say hello something much more beautiful Let's go.